An architectural and historical gem is hidden in the Mesa Verde National Park in the state of Colorado. The dwellings that were built into the cliffs by the Anasazi Indians has given this place the name of Cliff Palace. This ancient Native American culture had no written language and scientific and so historical information on the Anasazi is based on speculation. In Pueblo, Anasazi means the elder. These remarkable buildings were constructed without the benefit of metal tools and Cliff Palace is among the largest and most impressive cliff dwellings in Northern America. The dwellings were discovered in 1888 by two cowboys who must have been amazed when they stumbled across these ancient and magnificent structures. During the 6th century, the Anasazi began to settle on the plateau of the Mesa Verde, Spanish for green table, where they lived in caves and simple wooden shelters. They began by building their dwellings from lone bricks until in the latter part of the 12th century they moved into these cliff dwellings. It is however not known why the Anasazi settled here. In 1906, shortly after the sensational archaeological discovery of Cliff Palace, the Mesa Verde region and further ancient Indian settlements became protected areas by order of President Roosevelt. This amazing cliff dwelling comprises more than 200 living and storage rooms, as well as 23 that were used for cult ceremonies. It is the largest of its kind. This naturally sheltered village once accommodated up to 300. Technical building abilities of the Anasazi Indians, although simple, were nevertheless remarkable. Although the buildings were constructed with sun-dried loam bricks and extremely primitive tools, they were able to build multi-storey buildings and small towers.
cliff dwellings are located beneath the Mesa Verde Plateau in a dried out hollow of Cliff Canyon. Because of the location of the settlement, its former inhabitants had to be excellent climbers. Toward the end of the 13th century, the Anasazi abandoned their cliff dwellings. Even today, why they did this is not known. But a long and life-threatening drought was probably the reason that the Indians left their cliff villages. Until today, the remains of the Anasazi's prehistoric culture can be found in the traditions of their ancestors, the Pueblo people of New Mexico and Arizona. In the 16th century, the region's Spanish conquerors gave this people the name Pueblo, meaning village. Travelling to numerous cliff dwellings of Mesa Verde is only recommended for those who are not afraid of heights. Nevertheless, the arduous route to the Indian ruins is a rewarding experience. And that is why so many curious travellers climb the steep and narrow rock face. The precarious ascent to Cliff Palace is best done with the guidance of an experienced and knowledgeable ranger. Nearly 800 years have passed since the sudden and inexplicable disappearance and emigration of the Anasazi. Thankfully, their fascinating cliff palace dwellings in the Mesa Verde National Park have managed to survive the centuries.